So, you want to know how to lock your camera to the view? Well, you've come to the right place. Hey guys, welcome back to this by Kai and Kai, and today we are back once again taking a look at how to lock your camera to the view in Blender. We're going to go ahead and uh, just grab the camera real quick, and if at zero, you can see we can go into the camera's view. Now, of course, if you want to move your camera, you can hit G on your keyboard to move it around, and then of course you can double tap R and move it around, or you can tap RY to move it like that, or RX. Uh, and then R, Z, of course. But these ways are like super, uh, like they're really tedious to do like this sometimes. So you want to get something precise. And it's just like really annoying to like get it exactly how you want it. So sometimes it's better just to go over, go over here to the right hand side and hit this little tab button on the side, the little arrow until that popped open. And then go down to view and then make sure uh, lock camera to view is checked. And then you can use your middle mouse button. So the scroll wheel, so you can click the, click the scroll wheel on your mouse and then you can see that it will paint around um, to where you want it to be. So it'll rotate around uh, exactly where you want. And if you want to pan, like move around, hold down shift and then click the middle mouse button and you can go ahead and pan the camera around like this, as you can see. So you can use those both in combination. So I'm holding down shift and clicking the uh, scroll wheel down and doing that. And now if I let go of shift, you can see that it's just going to let me rotate around. I can get some nice angles. I can zoom in by scrolling my mouse wheel. And then maybe I want to get like a nice upshot of default cube here. Look at that. There you go. Nice. So now to get out of this mode, so you can like go around and look around your scene regularly, just uncheck camera to view. And now you can see that the camera is in fact down there instead of up here where it was before. So that's just a super easy way. Hit zero, go back into the camera's view. Super easy way to get the, uh, the shot that you want without having to spend so much time hitting G and Y and R to rotate and Z and all this stuff. It's crazy. So it's a very, very useful tip for the camera. I will see you ladies and gentlemen in the next beginner blender tutorial. I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one. But until then, bye-bye.